Richard Southern joins us now for the day's business news. Richard, there are changes coming to the housing market. What can we expect? Well, for the first time, Erica, since before the pandemic began, mortgage rates in Canada are heading higher. You know, they've been at record low levels for most of the past 12 months, but starting to move higher now. And that's because we've seen government bond yields, uh, interest rates start to creep up. So the lowest rate for a Canadian five-year fixed mortgage right now is 1.64%. Still historically pretty low, but that's up 25 basis points over the past week. We know TD Bank and National Bank are among the lenders who have hiked uh, mortgage rates. The other big banks may well follow. But, you know, Erica, the experts say this is unlikely to cool off the market any. We know the housing market here in the GTA is the hottest it's ever been and it's it's unlikely i think that we're going to see a big moderation there we you know the bank of canada just last week said it's starting to get concerned about what i call the frothy housing market but we'll certainly be keeping a close eye on this one all right and the lcbo has announced new hours for its shops what's the latest mondays just got a lot better erica we won't have a case of the mondays anymore <laughs> Uh, the LCBO is going to start uh, opening its stores again on, on Monday. Uh, this started yesterday, actually. Uh, the, the the liquor seller, though, says it will still continue to uh, restrict capacity and restrict some hours in accordance with the public health officials. But they will be open on Mondays from 10 till 8, most of the locations. It was this past March that the LCBO, uh, LCBO announced all its locations would remain closed on Mondays in accordance with the province's state of emergency, Eric. So coming full circle in March again. All right, and finally, what's this I hear about a new burger joint coming to town? As if we need another burger joint. Well, maybe we do. Sure. There's nothing wrong with another. Yeah. Uh, this one, if you've ever lived out west, you're going to know it. It's called Triple O's. Have you ever heard of this? I have not, no, and I did live in Manitoba for a bit. They're really big in, in Vancouver. That's where they mm. started, though. And so it's a, it's a popular burger chain. Burgers, fries, and shakes is what they specialize in. Anyways, they're going to open 30 locations here in Ontario, including six in the GTA. The first one opened today in Mississauga. There'll be one on Zenway Boulevard and Vaughan in the next month. Uh, Triple O's is a spinoff of White Spot Restaurants, which you may well have heard of, Canada's longest-running restaurant chain. The reason they're expanding now in this climate is this is very much a, a company leveraged towards drive throughs They have a, a deal with uh, Ultimar and Pioneer Station. So you're going to see a lot of these triple-O drive throughs opening throughout the GTA. Eric will have to go try one out and see how they uh, fare. I think so. I hope so. All right, 680's Richard Southern. Thanks, Richard.